It's been an issue regarding maintenance, and it still is due to the lack of manpower the agency has. During their budget hearing, Director of the Department of Parks and Recreation, Roque Alcantara, expressed that most of the island's sports facilities need an upgrade and cited one example to get his point across. The uh, sports complex, that building is just completely ignored, you know, so we, we want to get it looking bright and, you know, so people can notice it because right now it's just, it, 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 I, I won't even, you know, look at it when I drive by. Senator Tello Taitagui then questioned Alcantara on who maintains the Dededo Sports Complex. Alcantara confirmed that it was DPR. Also, Recreation Administrator Williams Tanet touched on the issues with the Northern Sports Complex. As far as the complex, we have three employees that are up there and they maintain, they try to maintain the facility as far as bush cutting, um, taking care of the restrooms and also uh, staffing for activities that take place you know, at night and on the weekends. It does need a lot of work. Um, the roof is leaking. If you know, there's 10 windows around the side. Uh, about four of them are ready to collapse. Mm -hmm. And if they do, and if someone's there, uh, uh, they'll get yeah, really injured, you know, probably uh, die if those windows could fall on someone. So those need to be addressed right away. Um, and also their air conditioning. So if we could get that done. Senator Taitagui did ask DPR Director Alcantara if they had set aside a budget to have these issues addressed. Having a, a budget for maintenance is really not uh, what I'm looking at right now because uh, the, the fastest way we can do uh, maintenance is to get a contractor to fix it. Senator Taitagui suggested that DPR put in place funding for maintenance of the buildings and sports facilities in their budget on a yearly basis to keep them open year-round for the public to enjoy. Daniel Perez reporting for KUAM News.